Welcome back to Hosted FTP Tutorials. Today we'll be introducing you to the mobile FTP app and FTP for Android. And FTP works just like any regular desktop FTP client and we're going to show you how to use and FTP to connect to your server and upload and download files and folders. Let's go ahead and begin. Start by opening the and FTP app and click the plus icon to open the site connection tab. If you don't already know your host name, username, and password, contact your admin or host provider to get all three pieces of information. Then simply fill in the blanks. We'll be connecting using hosted FTP, so where it says host, use ftp.hostedftp.com or your branded domain name. If you're a hosted FTP user, click the link in the description for branding instructions. Now, use the drop down menu to select your protocol, and now simply enter in your username and password and click Save. But what if I use SFTP or use a private key or SSH key? If you're an intermediate FTP user using SFTP, Select SFTP from the protocol drop down menu and next specify the remote default directory. Again, contact your admin or host provider if you don't know the default remote directory. To add your private key or SSH key, go to the advanced tab and here you can import your private or SSH key by browsing your phone. Click save and the connection will automatically appear on the AND FTP homepage. Now, anytime I open the AND FTP app, I'll be able to connect to my server right away. Now that we've connected, how do we upload and download? Once you've connected to your server, browse and open the directory you want to upload into. Using the icon at the top of the AND FTP app, switch between your local site, aka your phone, and your server. While in your local site, find the file you want to upload and click and hold it until you see a check mark. Now go back to your server directory to make sure you're currently inside the desired uploading destination then go to your local site and tap the upload icon at the top of AND FTP. To download a file or folder, follow the exact same process except you're locating the download directory in the local site aka your phone, selecting the file or folder from your server, and then Tap the icon while in your server directory to download to your phone. Now you know the foundation of using AND FTP to connect, upload, and download files and folders. If you want to learn more about AND FTP, including some additional features, tools like searching your phone or server directory, resume support, and third-party app sharing through your phone, check out part two of our AND FTP tutorial. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like to let us know what kind of content we should continue to make and comment to let us know what FTP client you'd like us to cover next. Thanks so much for watching. Check out www.hostedftp.com forward slash resources for more reviews, tutorials, and content or email support at hostedftp.com for all your FTP needs.